All right, Robert just pushed push number five. Like I said, I literally got in there and showed him the joystick on the left makes it drive forward and backward. The joystick on the right makes the blade go up and down and right or left. And I showed him the angle blade. And I showed him the automatic button for the slope assist. Now, this time I prompted him on push number six. I asked him to try running the blade himself and do not use the automatics on the slope assist. So this will be Robert's hand that runs the blade up and down. Slope assist is turned off, but the stable blade is still enabled. The stable blade helps a little bit, but that slope assist to me is the primary driver of him making a phenomenal push on his first try. Even without the automatics, he's doing a pretty good job, better than the average guy, about evening out the ups and downs in his push. I'm sorry, I got started looking at the got started looking at the bulldozer and not looking at the camera. Probably had that out of focus. He lost a good percentage of his dirt right about there where he's at. But he maintained some dirt and did make it to the end with a load or a quarter of a load. But a quarter of a load versus a, a pretty darn good load for a beginner to me is completely attributable to the slope assist feature. Again, this should be another pass without the automatics with a, a absolute greeny beginner running the blade himself. And that's more like what you would expect. this push I'll have him turn the automatics back on and see if he can smooth out those washboards that he just made all right watching him back up should give you an idea of where the washboards are at and how bad they are that first one is a pretty deep gouge in the ground and a pretty good sized mound of dirt that he wasted on the ground I prompted him to use the automatics again and see if he could level out or smooth out that washboard and get down here with the majority of a load of dirt. This will be the, I guess, like the eighth or the ninth load that he's pushed and uh, he'll be with the automatics on slope assist this time. And this is only the slope assist feature. There's no GPS. There's no laser set up today. This is just simply the slope assist feature turned on. if you could see that but as the dozer rolled over that mound that he made the uh, slope assist was still turned on in automatic mode and as the tractor pitched backward it mashed the blade down stalled him out
that's what you would normally expect from a beginner newbie on a bulldozer. like he may have it this time. Nope. Well, he didn't get his washboard smoothed out, but he did manage to come out of them with some dirt. We'll call that a win. From here, I'm going to say the slope assist makes a tremendous difference in the learning curve. It takes care of about a week or two's worth of skill in getting started.